The next question is, how do you balance work life and seeking knowledge? Uh, my humble opinion is not an answer to the question, but my stance and my opinion is uh, there's no balance between the two. If you balance things, then they have to be of the same value. So if you have two things and you put them on a scale and you are balancing them, they have to be 50-50. Can the dunya and the akhirah be balanced? No, it's not. Everyone's understood that. The dunya, you understand its reality, you understand what it is about, you do what you need for it, and you move on. You are here as a traveler. If you travel now from London to Birmingham, or London to Manchester, or one side of London to the next, and you stop at a petrol station, and you take your provisions, and you fill up the tank, when you go into this petrol station, are you going to fill up the trolley and take bags and bags of groceries? You are going to take what is enough for the journey. How many provisions do you need or how much provisions do you need for the dunya? You are living 60 to 70 years. Only few will pass this. You pack enough, inshallah ta'ala, for 60 to 70 years. When it is time to meet Allah in the akhirah, your bags are already packed. You are a musafir. You meet Allah jalla wa ala and you have no regrets. If you do this, ta'ish fi dunya sa'idan. You will live in the dunya content. And in the akhirah, great things await you, inshallah.